family, friends, fellow gamers, educators, and students. Welcome to Grumpy Gnome Gaming. I am Grumpy Gnome. Let's get some grump on in Banished. Here we go, Resumi. Dun, 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 dun. And this is the scene I left you with in the last episode. I don't even know what's going on here. It looks like we got a bunch of stuff planned. So I'm going to say we jump right into it and get our people running. Here we go. And they're off. We got nomads. We got traders. But first of all, we got some buildings. You are a roadless well. We'll take that. Okay, it looks like we're going for some happiness here. That's a school. There's a hospital. I wonder what this was. That is weird. We're building right next to a node. Well, let's... Should we start at the top? A grain silo. Something tells me we're going to be doing some baking. And you know what? We need some sugar processing going on. A windmill. Yeah, this looks like we got us a bakery district. Cool. Bakery. Bakery. Bakery and bakery. I wonder if I should leave these open down here so we can like get them manned. And you know, we'll just keep, we'll stay in this area for a while. One thing I'm noticing though, so far we have not had any large dock storage. Why do we need large dock storage if we have silos? And what are you? A smokehouse. A preservist and a preservist. Well, okay, we're getting our... But we still don't have any... There we go, sugar houses. Perfect. That's what we needed. And is this open? We may want to entertain dropping a couple more sugar houses up here. Only because I think sugar is like in our top five by quantity. Yeah, sugar cane is up at the top. We need to start processing that stuff. Let's finish this first. Another smokehouse? Okay, I don't know what. Why do we need smokehouses out here? And that sugar place won't quite fit there. I don't know why we need more dock storages either. Unless we wanted to keep the um, the only reason I could think that we would do this on top of the silos is to keep all of their products right here local. And that doesn't bother me. We can do that. So let's... Um, I guess we're going to open another smokehouse here, even though we don't have the meat for the smokehouse. We'll figure something out. If I have to, I could always put a fishing dock or something out here so we get some smoked fish going. Yeah, we're going to build it. Why not? But back up here, let's, t let's entertain this whole sugar thing again. So we're going to go here. We're going to go here. And somewhere down here is a sugar... I think you're sugar? Sugar house. What are you? Sugar refinery. Okay. Now, one of these is really like stone and modern looking, and the other one is rustic. This is the modern one, and that just doesn't fit our aesthetics, even though I'm questioning what the heck is that. That's our windmill. I don't know why I would have chosen those, except that. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay, that, it's a lot of extra room. It's a, I don't want to waste that much space. Uh, smokehouse, we actually, no, we could not have dropped it in there. I mean, as nice as, as, nice as an idea as that would have been, no. But we should probably keep, you know, we might be able to put one right up here in the corner. 
like right there there and that might stay out of the arc a sugar house i am almost thinking about doing it as a matter of fact i am almost thinking it to the point where make it happen um are you in the arc of this forester no you're not look at that perfect so let's grab us a road Let's find out where this thing, there it is, go right there. Okay, come around, go up. There's the edge of it, so we're going to go right to there. I mean, we could have gone around it. Is this going in? Oh, that's weird. Okay, right to there, and that's it. That looks like it. And you know what, just to make it aesthetically pleasing, we'll come up around the building. And go up to, I don't know, maybe, yeah, maybe just around the building. Okay, we can go to there. Perfect. If I have to, I'll put a little dock right there and throw something out. But I don't think we're even going to get to that point because I think this episode is nearing an end. Okay, are you the water wheel? Yes, you are. And because we almost have, tw well, it's not even twice, but I think we're going to do you for firewood. And I'm going to throw two people into you. And let's go one, two. I don't know if we even had two before or not. But I don't have a question mark, so it looks like it's working. Okay, what can we make here? So we could make it out of wheat, corn, barley, oats, rye, or rice. I don't want to use oats because I use that for my domesticated animals. So let's look at rice, corn, or wheat. Rice, corn, or wheat. Rice. I think that's going to be our winner. And there's corn, but rice is doubling, is double the production. So let's go rice, and we're going to put two people into you. One, two. So close you down. You are going to be rice until we run out of rice. I'm going to put two people into you. One, two. What's our labor force look like? 14? That's cool. And you know what? We're not building that much. So I think I'm going to knock our builders down to... Uh, you know what? Let's take it down to 20. Boom. There we go. Cha-ching. Now we got some more laborers to play with. Okay. Uh, the silos are coming in really nicely. And it doesn't look like they need to be manned. What are these? These are the bakeries. What are we going to bake? Flour, 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 cheese, flour, walnuts, flour, apricot, flour, and sugar. God, there's a whole lot of stuff here. I would really love to do the pies, but we just don't get the, the ingredients for those. And that's frustrating. How's our, how's our egg count doing? By name, eggs eggs e right there well come back oh we don't even have a lot of eggs holy nuts on a biscuit we just don't have we don't have a lot of cheese bread we're doing okay with apricot why are we rocking apricots for some reason oh it's because it's in alphabetical order he 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 okay. oh my gosh i had an old man moment well, holy nuts. Somebody help us here. What are we going to do? I don't know what to do. I guess, you know what? Maybe we'll just make a little variety. Hard tack? No, that's not pleasant. Uh, walnuts? We've got walnuts growing. What's our walnut count look like? 
I can't imagine they're using walnuts for anything by quantity. No, we want to go by name. Walnuts. And we got zero. Okay, of course, because it's in a freaking node. Those nodes just aren't working for us. Well, here we go. Let's just um, cheese bread, nut bread, fruit cake, sugar cookies. Well, we've got some sugar refinery going on. You know what? Maybe, maybe if we force the sugar, sugar cookies, two people, we're, we're just going to force the sugar to be used up. I don't want to do that, though. That's not happy. Muffins takes blueberries. Well, that would be fun, wouldn't it? Get some pie action going. Honey. You know what? I think we're going to get into the pie business. So what do we got? We got apple pie, cherry pie, pecan pie. And I need another pie. Or something that looks like that. Fruitcake? No, let's let's do apple pie first. And then we're going to put two people into you. And we're going to go one, two. That's happy. Close you down. Let's come over here. And we're going to go to cherry pies. And then we're going to put two people into you. And we're going to go one, two. And then we're going to close you down. And then we're going to come over here and do the pecan pie. Like that. And then we're going to do whoop, two people. And then we're going to go one, two. And then we're going to close you down. 36 laborers. We're still doing good. Oh, and there's our pies. So we're, we're golden. This is, oh my God, this is going to be a sweet bakery area. Okay, what kind of meat do we have a lot of? We don't even have venison. Yeah, the next, the next season we're going back to the marine climate. Because I really want my venison again. Do we have any kind of meat that they can use here at the uh, pork? We got 3,000. Mutton. We don't even have a lot of mutton. <sighs> Jeez. I don't even know what I'm looking for. Goat meat is 1,500. Doug and his goats. Man, they, they just keep producing for us. Well, what are you making? You're using venison cuts, and that's not working for us. Do I have any animals out here in this area? I don't. We might want to throw some some smaller animals right into this area here. Maybe we can go goats, pigs, and sheep. Cause, or we wait until we get some type of, what do you call it? It's poultry. Maybe some chickens or leghorns. And then, but I don't want more feathers. I think we're feathered out. Feathers. F E F E F E. Fe yeah, we're feathered out. We don't need more feathers. Let's do that. Let's go in order. Let's go ahead and go uh, goats. When I say in order, I'm going in alphabetical order. So this one's going to be goats. I'm already going to throw a person into here. Well, maybe. I don't know why not. Oh, maybe you got to work it. Okay. Over here is going to be pigs. And then throw somebody in. Oh, got to work it. <laughs> work it, work it. And this is going to be sheep. And work it. And hopefully they're going to go in. Now let's go split some of the... Um, we'll go back and split them. Well, there's the question marks. Could that be because there are no animals there? You know what? Let's do it right now. 
this should tell me where we're at. We're right up here. We want to come over here. And ah, go away, you. There we go. So should we take them off of the side over here? So you are pigs. You are goats. Goats, I'm going to split you. Pigs, I'm going to split you. And then sheep. Let's go ahead. This one looks like it has more, so let's go ahead and split it. I hope that, did that just register? Yeah, 10 out of 25. Okay, and hopefully they're going to go where they're supposed to go. Oh, man, we got some stragglers out here on the side. Whoa, they got some in their yard. All right, so that, that should be good. Let's go back to our area again. That was up here. And hopefully we got the animals coming in over here. Why do you still have a question mark on you? I can't figure it out. Is that going to give us... There we go, one... Okay, who are you? You are a herdsman. Really? What are you herding? What are you not herding? Was that area? Oh my gosh, we still got these pastures. Oh my gosh, where are we here? And you know what? That's another thing about a smaller map is you don't forget where your areas are. At least not as much. What am I going to do? I want the map so I can see where I'm at. Oh, we're all the way down here. Oh, that's right. I remember we were doing this. We kind of set this up to be built and then just kind of walked away from it. We neglected it. Well, let's go ahead and finish this. Let's um, road. I guess, are you the bottom? I don't know where the bottom is. I don't know what's going on. I guess I can't build a road around you, can I? Oh, maybe that's as far down as I could come. But can we pass? Is this a pasture? It sure is a pasture. And they're still building this. That's really what's going on. Well, this might just be more of our big animals, like the Frisians and the buffaloes. I think that's what we're going to put down there. This could actually be two crop fields right here. And we could do more crop fields here. Yeah, oh my gosh, we have a lot of room. And here's where we were building a cross. Okay, you're the refinery. Let's get somebody into you. Um, there we go. And that's going to start producing furnace fuel for the lower river area. Looks like we're getting some glass already. That's cool. So this area is up and running. Perfect. How are these doing? 6% full? And they're just getting all kinds of stuff in here. Perfect. Good, 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 good. Cloth, that's a good sign. Cloth, that's a good sign because remember, that's what we're going to use for our, for our shipyard here. Perfect. All right, I don't know why I've got this thing up here. Herdsman, let's get rid of that. That's going to be down in H. I got one too many. Okay, we'll take one out. All right. I think uh, I think we're groovy. What's our count doing? Looks like we got some... Hey, I don't need nomads. We're doing good. That's not too busy. As a matter of fact, we can kick this down to uh, 10. That gives us a few more laborers. And what else are we doing? Let's go back to our uh, bakery district. Back to the bakery district. Yeah. I, I want to say that we've pretty much filled this map in. Uh, lessons learned from this is that the nodes, the fruit nodes, do not produce. They can't keep up with this population. 
And I really would have to, I mean, just looking at this, it almost looks like a quarter of our map is crop fields and pastures. And we're still not, okay, yeah, I guess we are making enough food, but I just don't like these numbers over here. These, um, it's like anything that you want to do something with, you can't. Early summer, hey, they might actually get this cleared. Did we get our animals yet? 16 out of 15, so that's good. That means we've got goats. 12 out of 13, hey, we've got pigs. And we got sheep. Perfect. And so you know what that means? That means for these two smokehouses, since there is no setting for goats, I'm going to go ahead and do one for the sheep, which is going to be mutton, if they even have mutton here. There it is, mutton log and barrels. So what the heck, hangijat, hangijat. And, of course, the next one is going to be the, the kielbasa. So we're going to use mutton in one. I'm actually going to kick this up into two people just because we got the laborers. And for this one here, let's go ahead and do the kielbasa. And we're going to go ahead and put two people into there also. Whoops. You know what? I still got other things next to them that we need to um, get manned. Oh, we got people. Sugar houses. Oh, my God. I want to max these out. How many? Oh, we could only put two in. All right. One, two. Sugar cane. Wait. Sugar makes sugar cane or I'm using sugar cane to make sugar? I'm using sugar cane to make sugar. Okay, that's that's good. Sugar cane, put two people in. And I should really see if I could find my other. Just out of curiosity. Oh, yes. <gasps> there are too many. I don't know how many sugar things I had. Oh, and what are you, a preservist? Oh, what are we making? What are you making, first of all? Fruit jam. You're making fruit out of apples. We should probably use a fruit that we're not, like quince. What are we doing with our quince? Nothing. And what other thing are we not doing? Do we have strawberries? Strawberries is the place to be. No, we don't. Then again, I haven't seen strawberries come in either. Um, we could pickle some type of a meat. Duck. Chicken. There's something interesting. How is our duck and chicken population doing? Duck meat. Only a thousand? Chicken should probably be a little higher. Just be, oh my gosh, we don't have any either. I can't explain that. Oh, and one more up here. Boom. Boom. There we go. Now we're rocking. You know what we don't have here, though, that I'm just now noticing? Is houses. We don't have any houses here for people. We got some down here. But that's not enough for everybody. We need to make something here. What can we make? I should probably do the quince. Because we really need to get rid of that. Well, I don't want to say get rid of it. But I'm going to put two people in. And one, two. Do you have two? Two, yeah. Oh, you're just making sugar. Oh, wait a second. Aren't sugar. Okay, perfect. Don't know what I was looking at. That's what I thought I was looking at. 
apple. I don't want to make fruit jam out of apple, though. Beef, radish, pepper. Pickled eggs. Do we, do we have a lot of eggs, don't we? No, we don't. Gosh, man, we suck. We don't have anything. Do we have mulberries? Mulberries. Oh, we don't have mulberries either. Oh, my gosh. Do, 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 do. Cucumbers, onions. Cucumbers, onions. Well, let's go down to O first. Onions, 325. Cucumbers, zero. Awesome. Duck meat. Man, we suck. We totally suck. It's got to be duck. Pickled eggs. For some reason, eggs just sound like what we should have. Eggs. Doggone it. Salt. I know I've got salting houses. Do we even have salt? No, we don't. Oh, Crumbs. Spirits. Well, dog got it. I'm going to do duck. What the heck? Let's do two people in there. Whoops. Uh oh, why can't I not? Oh my gosh, I'm out of laborers. <coughs> Hold on. Did we lose a teacher? Did we lose a teacher? It does not look like we lost a teacher. Diphtheria. Cool. <laughs> Let's kill some more people. I don't think we lost us a teacher. That's good. Well, let's go back to the bottom. Dock worker, vendor. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do here is pull all of our builders and put them into laborers. Are we at 100% educated? Yes, we are. We 1% of our people are still running around naked. I don't know, man. We got us a little, little colony someplace here. Anyway, this is done. I wanted to get some housing action going. Housing is going to bring more people. What type of houses can we put in over here that's going to look nice with this area? And for some reason, I, I don't want to do the dock shanties, even though that probably is the nicest looking thing for this area. First of all, let's square this off. We need to make a, we need to grid this. So what do we got here? We got eight. Gosh darn it, that doesn't split. 21. Okay, there we go, 11. 11 across, right to there. Come down, right to there. Okay, that cuts that in half. It was eight going down, so we can actually do... Oh, wait, these are not 11 across. So threes will fit in. Four, four, threes will fit. Let's do threes. And I'm going to start, I guess, in the back row. But see, then we're going to come down one, two, three, and then one, two. That doesn't fit nicely. Three. You know what might fit nicely in here and something we haven't used yet are these. My, I'm going back to my, my forest homes. God, I love these. These are the best homes. And of course, you guys are going to argue with me on that one, but it doesn't matter because I'm right. Oh, man. But you know what? 
They don't fit nicely. I still got one extra. What to do? What to do? There, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Now that doesn't fit. They don't fit nicely in there. Okay, let's go back to shanties. Ah, uh, crumbs on a biscuit, nuts on a cracker. These are the things we do for free. And shanties. Let's see if we put one there and we come over one, two, three, four, five. That doesn't fit nice either. Do I split this in half? No, because that's going to leave me two. Isn't it nice when this is the biggest thing you need to worry about? We could do that and then put a put more storage in the center. Let's do that. Let's drop you there. Change the color. And do that. And then come up one, two, three change the color, go there, and then come across, change the color there. Oh, I guess that does fit. Change the color, go there, change the color, go there. All right, that gives us a, a little housing grid to work with. Let's go ahead. Uh, first of all, no, I don't want to get our people running because I'm going to I'm going to run them fast just so that they all find their hospitals respectfully. There we go. And like I said, we may go ahead and just drop in the storage barns. That's it. Oh, and I did figure out where the other storage barn was that I was looking for. It's under this red ketchup thing here. Then you go here, and then you go to the barns. And I'm pretty sure it's, is it this one? Yep, that's it. That's the one I was looking for before, and I couldn't find it. Is there any variation to this? No, there isn't. But you see, this would go right there, just like that, in between the two. And I'd come on down here, just like that right there and bringing this one down right there okay let's go ahead that's going to give us two four six eight ten twelve people you know what we may need more than that should we go ahead and just populate this area out why not and we'll see what that does um here we go and i'm going to change the color of that see there's my door and so let's do one there change the color Come all the way across there change the color one two three drop one there change the color come across drop one there change the color come down to the road drop one there change the color come across right to there and let's pull the barns out again and then we don't have to worry about this area anymore And let's zoom in a little bit so we can get close up and come across right to there. Ching. Come on down. Right to there. Ching. Come on down. Ching. And I think that's it. Oh, roads. And then we're going to get our people running. Do, 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 do. Come across. And right to there. Come across. Just like that. All right. Make it run. Now let's get our speed up to 10. There we go. And hopefully this number is either going to go down or it's not going to go down. But I'm not worried about it. We have no builders. We do need some. Should we? How's our tools doing? Tools are still kind of low. Maybe now's a good time to check out some traders. What do you got? You got food. We don't need food. Um, no, don't need any of your stuff. What do you got? Sheep, trade chickens. Nope, ain't doing that. And close you down. 
Any more traders? There's another one. What do you got? Omelets. How the heck are you making omelets? And, whoa, I didn't even get to look at everything. Here we go. Boots. No, we make our own. And is that it? No. Nope. Oh, what do you got? Oh, wow. We got people here that need to be working. Oh, well, my labor force is really taking a dump here. Seeds. Well, if I needed sugar, that's what I would grab. We got cotton. We got a plum forestry thing. And we don't need herbs because we're kind of making our own. So I'm going to dismiss this one. And what are you? You need zero. No, you got one. Are you the one with zero? You got zero. Can we put somebody in you? Nope. Um, oh my gosh, stop. And this is what we're afraid of. We could do something really fun and gamble. <laughs> See if we can make it without losing a, a teacher. Oh, that's scary, though. I need a scavenger. Oh, I just had a laborer, too. Come on, give me a laborer. Give me a laborer. I don't know where we could pull somebody from. I think we're losing people faster than we're getting them. Well, that's the way it goes. You know, this game is very generational. And you know, depending... Oh, there we go. Cha-ching! Okay. And now, there we go. Come on, labor force, go up. There we go. Yay, we're getting laborers. Of course, that's really, really walking a thin line. Okay, where do we go next? I don't know. I want to say we probably have done everything in this game that we set out to do. 1,700 citizens. I mean, I could do what I did in the last game. Remember when we wanted to hit 3,000 and I just let in 300 nomads just to hit the 300 mark? But that's not fun. Are you stopping right here? If you stop there, I'll look at you. Food. We don't need food. Well, if I needed a labor force, which I pretty much do, I can always pull it from the traders. Why don't we do that? Traders, where are they? Traders, traders, 45 of them. You know what? Let's do it. Pull them all. And that way we can assign them as needed. I still have... Why is there still stuff that we're building? I don't get it. Boom. There we go. 20 builders. Okay. There's a little window of opportunity. Kind of like an insurance in case we do lose a teacher. Oh, my God. Okay. That's for trader. Because, see, the thing about the trading posts is that the boats are still going to come even though there's nobody there. You're a market and you don't have anybody? That's interesting. I kind of want to put one, two. I kind of want to keep people in the markets, though. Because I want to keep the food moving. Where are you? Are you with the beekeeper? You sure are. Get there, because that's going to bring us food. You're going to bring us everything except animals and seeds. I can't think of anything we need. Tools. Tools. There we go. Why don't we do, why don't we do something even here? You got 100 
that's got an 8 value. I've got an 8 value, and I'll give you 100 of mine. There we go. We've had this conversation before. Was that it? I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. So, trade, dismiss, boom. We just got ourselves 100 more tools. Perfect. I'm not concerned about the firewood. Holy nuts, is this a new disease? Or is that still the same one? I think that's the same one. They're just not finding hospitals. <coughs> yeah, you know what? I think uh, I think this might just be our, our final episode here. Um, you need somebody? We ran a good town. If, like I said, if I... Oh, cool. Well, we're going to end it with a fire. And, of course, we're going to speed this up to kill them faster. Burn, baby, burn. And I don't even know where... Oh, is that... Yeah, there, that's water right there, isn't it? Boom, perfect. Rebuild. Do I, do I have a school over here? I don't know if I have a school. Doc? I don't, do I? Yeah, you know, if I had to, to do this over again, I would probably... Small dock marker? Yeah, because normally where I put a church, I put a school. And I'm not seeing it here. I mean, they've got their... Are these rice wine? No, these are rice wine stills. So at least they got their priorities set, you know, alcohol over school. But I don't know. Hey, numbers are going up. I don't know. What are we building for 45? Oh, those houses. That's it. We're building those houses. Wow, our sick numbers are going up. That's interesting. Okay, wow, there's more rice wine over here. You know what we might want to do? Look at all this copper stuff that we got. And copper, we looked at it a few episodes ago, has no value in this game. I mean, copper pipes are 20, but that's not going to keep anybody happy. Do you not have anybody here? Smoked fish? Yeah, definitely. Two people. Let's get going. One, two. And I guess I could drop you down to 15. You don't have something. Yeah, there's a couple things I would probably do differently in this game. But, I mean, overall, it, it was successful. We got it off the ground. Where are you running to, you sick puppy, you? No, man, go to the hospital. So, let's take a look and see how those houses are coming along. Whoa, was there something here? You would almost think that there should have been a um, another dock market right there. Let's do the flippy thing for a minute. Just take a look at this. There we go. We flipped her... And something needs to go here. And I just can't figure out what. And the only thing that really comes to mind is another dock storage. Docks here, small dock storage. And do the flippy thing. And, oh, wow, there's no room for a dock storage. So whatever it is, it's only a two-wide something. And really, quite frankly, if it's only a two-wide, I'd probably drop in another... Maybe another rice wine still place. We could do that. 
We could run another. Oh, there's our 45. We could have run another dock out right here. Make another row of docks here and double up our rice. But I think I'm, I'm satisfied with this build. Let's flip it around again to get to bring it back to the. Um, this is the perspective that it should be in from north to south. And we're really at the top of the I'm pretty sure we're close to the top. Yeah, this is the top right up here. Uh, one thing that we saw that we could do is we can actually dig into this mountain and find the edge of the game. So we could flatten all this other stuff out. I'm, I tried something new with this. Oh man, we could have put another quarry or something in over here. We tried something new with the Appalachian uh, build. I can't say I'm flattered with it. It seems like it's got a lot of limitations. I um, I learned not to use precious mines anymore just because what they produce has no value. Um, we've learned, well, we've known that the marble and the jade just rock. It totally rocks. And that's probably, if my mining districts is probably going to be strictly jade and marble for the future builds don't need gold don't need silver don't even need copper we got a lot of copper do we need it no and you know what and also building a lot of the stuff like the whole components and the building supplies they're not necessary uh, sure, it puts variety into the game, but, I mean, if you're just looking for a simple town that's going to get you what you need, there we go, get a small, get a bigger window going on here. Uh, trading posts, yeah, once again, it's, what are you bringing? Liquor, there we go. Fun stuff. Uh, the tools are still going down. So if I were to continue this game, I would definitely um, probably drop a few more blacksmiths. Uh, we can still buy tools. See, once again, look at this. There's my eight count. So I can grab a hundred of those. I can come over here to my eight count of linen, grab a hundred of these. And then there's just my even trade. That's not even grumpy math, as Kendi calls it. That's just uh, regular math. There we go. And that got us 100 more tools, which will probably last us 10 more minutes of game time. This looks like a butcher. A sheep butcher. Sure, we'll put somebody in there. Don't need to, but we did. Yeah, it looks like we got our, our sickness under control. Um... Uh, Labor count still going down. If I was really worried about it, I can always let a group of nomads in. You see, he's in the hospital right here. There's our health center, one patient. So he's going to get better, he or she. Look at this. A lot of meat's coming in, but where the heck is it going? And see, if I wanted to do this, we can simply, okay, where are they? They're at the immigration office or they're at the immig uh, the nomad well. And there's 200 of them right there. So let's just look at this for a second. Citizens, 1726. If I bring in 200 more, that's 1926. And that puts us 75 away from what we wanted to call endgame. So we're there. We we're there. And besides, everybody else is starting new new uh, seasons. And we can shout out to them. Ashanton, she just started a new season using a Steam download for her mods. Uh, Derby Moose, 
uh, you just ended your season. I think you're uh, four games into the next one. So, you know, you keep rocking. What do we got here? Avocados. Never got avocados off the ground, man, for some reason. And that would have been a nice aphrodisiac for us, you know. Maybe that would have increased our population if we actually could have uh, made more. Yeah, not really. Growing iron ore in a greenhouse. There's a story to tell your friends. All right, man. I think we're going to... Are you serious that we've got a school here that we're not utilizing? I think we're going to call this the episode. You guys, thanks a lot for coming on this trip with me. We just took a journey to Appalachia. We got it built up real nicely. Sugar Mountain is productive. And uh, Tonya, I have not heard back from you with the water world. So I'm going to throw it out there again. Uh, if you want to comment on this one, I do promise you that that would be the next one. If I don't hear back from you, say within a week or so, I am going to start a new season and I guess let's open it up again if uh, anybody has a request for what they would like to see, what type of geography, terrain, climate in the next one. Let me know. I am Grumpy Gnome. I'm out of here. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please do so. If you do subscribe or if you already have, please tell 10 people. With that said, we're out of here. Five, four, three, two, one, and take care. Bye-bye.